Hey YouTubers, it's Bowzone here. We got some more Kerbal Space Tour Rim. We launched basic a couple of times yesterday, or a couple of days ago. Um, we're back here. Um, we're going to be launching some more rockets with the new stuff we unlocked. Blah. And we need more of that delicious science, so we're going to get out our command pod. Simple, simple little command pod. Very, very basic. Now if we go to fuel tanks, we actually have one. We do not want it. It is not worth much. But we have this, a new uh, solid fuel booster of a bigger size. We're not going to put that on. We're going to go over to structural. We now have a decoupler. So now we can literally shut off these boosters and no longer use them. I'm just grabbing these parts out because we'll be doing some things. Heat shield. Best thing to put on your spaceship. If you don't have a heat shield... It, then why are you playing the game? That's pretty much it. Why are you playing the game? Uh, utilities. Yes, we got some new things. We got side shoots, um, which I'm going to not... I'm going to put one on because we're going to be carrying a heavier payload. Go. There we go. It's on. Okay. I should need to scroll down here. Zoom in a bit. Scroll up. Take the heat shield off. Put it over here. Go into science, and now we have this. The Science Junior. This is a big piece of science, and this is not the biggest piece. There is a huge thing solely for science. It is colossal. I don't use it. It's the science... It's, it's basically the science center. It's the much bigger version of this. And this is, I believe... Let me see, let me see. Uh, where's the size? Does it say what size it is? Uh, but there's like sizes in the game and it has the biggest size. So we're going to use symmetry mode on four. We're going to put four rockets on. Like that. We're going to go grab our boosters again. We're going to take the flea. The little tiny flea. Oh, pff. yeah, we want to thrust into the earth. We're going to put these on. We're going to go into these guys. We're going to lower the thrust limit. Let me check it that it went on all. Okay, we're going to move this with this one. With the decoupler sep separated. We're going to go back into... Well, let me do this. I get that glitch where it displays multiple... It displays the name of something when I'm not even selecting it. So we're going to want two. And let's go move over here. Ooh, ooh, what's going on? Okay. This may take be a long flight. I'm going to call this one. Call this one, I believe. We're going to call this one easy. It's going to be easy going out there. No, it's not. No, it's not going to be easy. It's a spaceship. It can blow up. And I don't want to lose Jebby. Jebediah, you are my bro. Bros for days, but we need to go collect more science. So we're out on the mission to go get more. Uh, we're gonna make sure everything's in case, and we're not using normal normal rockets yet. We need more science to unlock our first big enough fuel tank to actually start controlling our own engine, which is what the throttle is for. And every time I launch my ship, I drop my throttle to absolutely nothing. Let's check our staging, turn on our RCS and ACS. Everything's a check, everything's a go. Okay, and launch. Okay, launching. Everything's firing. And I just realized I forgot to put radiators on. There's a really good chance that this is going to overheat in the atmosphere and explode into a giant fireball. Thumbs up for that, eh? No, not really. But, while we're flying, we're going to just get some si junior science right here. Observe materials, bay. Just going to click a quick amount of science. Be like, hmm, hmm. As you can see, from this one collection, we got 17.5. And we're actually going to reset it, because we're going to wait. Okay, it's closing. We're hitting 
We're hitting high speeds. We really gotta calm down. So I'm gonna turn. We're going to brush. To th we're going to be turning, I believe, towards the east, and de decrease our speed. That really won't do much. Uh, the thing about boosters is, once you turn them off, you cannot shut them off. So right now they're just gonna keep going straight up. I think we're exploding. No, oh, okay, never mind. Our, th our boosters are getting very, very low, but we're keeping a sustained th throttle. We got very little gas left, but we're still going. I'm gonna shut up now. Let's take some crew report. Let's see if we can get some science from that. I do not know why I'm getting lag spikes. No idea. Okay, we're about to lose our main thruster. Cooper, okay, reset this. There's nothing good. Okay, we have lost our main thruster now. Okay, we lost our main thruster. So now we're working off of these fleas. These fleas will keep us... We're slowing down right now. We're dropping speed. The fleas will keep us moving, but they're not that strong. They're a flea. They really won't do much. I was hoping to get here, if you look above where it may say atmosphere, there's blue, then a lighter blue, and then faint blue, and then there's nothing. If we could get into this lighter blue and I can activate this guy, like right now, I believe I can get a good amount of science. And, let's see, do I get it is the question. I get the same amount of stuff, so I'm going to keep that data. Thank you for that data. And I'm going to now... Uh, inject from my rockets isn't that badass I still got my heat shield so all good there okay now it's all about falling just like Titanfall I, I'm gonna do that I'm just gonna make a tight I'm gonna try and make a Titan in this game and drop it from high atmosphere and see if it survives the landing I'll tell you this now it's not going to it's just gonna go splat literally it's just gonna splat on the floor and so we're hitting 10,000 we speed up time bang 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 ba -ba bang ba bang okay and now we're going to start falling back down right now okay yep we are now falling we're dropping speed we're going to increase speed so I will deploy hopefully in time deploy the chute this will slow us down a bit it will tear off it's going to tear off that's a tactic anyway you just meant to give some support when we hit it opens big deploy the other two now we have three shoots yeah physics say that two shoots can definitely intercept through each other bravo Bravo. Right now we're just slowly floating down. Dun, 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 dun. Um, after we bring this science in, we'll have enough to get the next rockets, which is I'm going to, this, I don't know how long this video, I'm going to make a very large rocket. We're going to get into deep space. This will be a very, very risky flight. Um... There's a chance that when we re-enter the atmosphere, because we will be exiting the atmosphere, if we make it back and we survive, that means a whole lot of science, um, or we'll explode when entering the atmosphere. It doesn't matter. It, yeah, it does. Because if we explode on this one retry, then I'm going to reset and I'm going to end the video. I don't. I will not have enough time to launch a secondary rocket. Um, but the flea is landing, it's carrying a good amount of science. I don't know if I should. Actually, yeah, I'm going to. 
I'm going to EVA out of this. Grab dirt. I'm going to grab dirt. Believe it or not, did the th the thruster literally made it back to the surface? How did it not explode? That's that's our main thruster right there. It's still there. It didn't get destroyed on its way down. That is amazing. And I can't believe it didn't despawn either. It should have. Let me slow down the speed here and keep it on two. Dropping the speed. Here we go, here we go, we're gonna hit touchdown. Three, four, two, one, and boop! Touchdown, touchdown. Let's take a uh, crew report. See if we can get any signs from that. Hey, 1.5. Yeah, you're home. Okay, Jebediah, you're gonna get out. And you're gonna jump off your spaceship. Yeah, smart tactic. Um, some Kerbals have different abilities. Like, Jebediah, he is a pilot, meaning he can use ACS and RCS at full ability. Um, Bob, for instance, is a scientist. He gives you more research points. And, oh, what the freak. Okay, I'm just gonna stand here and I'm going to just, I'm just going to take this surface sample. Okay, there's nine signs. I'm going to take this EVA report. I'm gonna keep that science. And I'm gonna go like this. I'm going to recover this vessel right now. I don't know how a person is vessel, but hey, don't shoot me. But um, the ship will not despawn. It will literally be parked right outside. I can go and grab that and get the 17.5 science it is holding. And I believe a review a view too, so yes. We can get plenty of science right now and probably unlock the third tier of parts. 15.5 we have right now and we jumped all the way up to 27.5 See like I said, it's parked literally right there you Can just click on easy And recover her and there we go boom we are now at 46 science We got all that science jewel Um so let's see here. Yep, we have that done so we can go for stabilizing. Stability. Never mind, not stabilizing. Stability has three parts. Ooh, ooh, all good stuff. Yes, let me get that. Okay, we now have that. And right here, general rocketry. Or, yeah, rocketry. It's a rocketry. It's a tree. And if you touch it, it turns into a rocket. But as you can see, we get our we get our second engine. We got one down here. And we get our first decent fuel tank. But we get this this solid fuel booster. That's taking us to outer space. And it will. It will. We're going to space. <laughs> and most of this flight, I'll be constantly going like into the map. Um, I'm going to be using a cheat command so I can warp time while thrusting. Don't do it. I'm going to be doing it. It's not a smart idea because it can make your ship go wonky and either do two things. One, make your whole ship flip upside down and go straight back to Earth. Or two, snap in half and completely explode. So, yeah. So, I guess we're going to change easy into normal. I guess we're going to be calling him, we're changing a she into him, and we're going to be making a much larger rocket, and it's going to be carrying a, some goo, probably two goo canisters, and one science junior along with it. And we're going to be collecting as much out of reach science as we can. Okay, so here we are. Now we got some special things now, if we take this off, and we take this off right here 
I'm going to science right away. I'm going to go grab the goo containers. I'm going to go turn this on too. And let me just place these guys on. So, I'm all good here. Let me change the... Oh, why, why am I hitting alt? Let me hit R, I believe. Yeah. R, mirror mode. We place that. Hold on, wait. Okay, there we go. Let me turn it on to radio. Okay, let's keep going then. Um, let's see here. Let's use some fuel tanks. Huh. We're gonna have to use a lot of these. Probably three would be a decent amount. Which I'm going to use. I'm gonna use three of these. They don't hold a lot, but... No, screw it. We're gonna go four. We're gonna go four on this thing. And for engines, we're gonna be taking the swivel. The retaliant goes faster but the swivel will help us with turning because we're gonna want to turn when we're when we hit when we're entering space and if we go into structural we now have what's called a radial decoupler and this is what you want to put your boosters on because with the radial decoupler you basically strap your rockets onto this and when you no longer need your boosters you hit the space key they get Chucked off of our ship. Well, that will be all for today. Please leave a comment. Leave a like. And see you later.